I was researching and I had a question that tell me five words in Urdu that you have learned. And then I come across a video where Suleiman is speaking in Urdu and I was like, oh my goodness. I went back to the video and heard it again because you were speaking quite, uh, you know, fluently. So, Urdu mein baat karte hain aap log. Urdu mein baat karte hain. Kaafi achhi Urdu hai aap logon ki. Alhamdulillah. Itni bhi nahi achhi. Charon to Ammi Abbu. Ammi Abbu. Aap us interview mein kaafi deer aap Urdu mein guftugu karte rahe the. Acha. Lekin aisa hi hai ki hamari walda ne hume Urdu itna nahi Urdu unhone sikhaya lekin hamari panch bahne hain. All older than us. Okay. Bada bhai. So we are eight siblings. So Mas and Man sabse young and we grew up in Norway. तो उधर नॉर्वेजियन ही बोलते रहे सारे नॉर्वेजियन में जवाब भी है वो लेकिन वालदेन से उर्दू तो घर में उर्दू में बात करते थे आप वालदेन से लेकिन भाई बहनों से अच्छा अम्मी अबू से ओके सो नासिर आपको आती है उर्दू या आई अंडरस्टैंड व्हाट इस यू अंडरस्टैंड फाइव सिस्टर्स वन ओल्डर ब्रदर दे द यंगेस्ट ये तो आपने दिस यू हैव रिमेम्बर्ड दिस इज व्हाट दिस इज बट हैव दे एवर ट्राइड टू प्ले अ ट्रिक ऑन यू बिकॉज़ ये आपस में दे मस्ट बी टॉकिंग इन उर्दू बिटवीन टू नॉट पॉसिबल not possible with him no. but they can try they can try yeah. they've tried but you know like did they try ever no no they haven't tried okay. the thing is that if they have like a long 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 conversation my brain is turned off yeah. then it doesn't pass <laughs> but if my brain is turned on yeah. it, for me it's pretty easy to catch yeah. two and two together yeah. you know so with me particularly like when it comes to language i'm very like sticky brain so once i get one word if it's me, hot, you, there, here, location, and also item, whatever, it, I just pick and make the whole image and then I understand what's oh. Also body language, he understands and body, body language. Because we dance, you know, we see yeah. the body language. True. So what does my body language tell you? It's like, you ready to ask questions. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> that was such an easy answer. Yeah. Come up with a better answer, please. <laughs> I, I must be saying more than that. <laughs> So Nasir, how is your introduction to the Pakistani household environment? Anything that you can tell us that really fascinates you or your first impression? My first friend is Pakistani, okay. like ever in my life. Mm -hmm. uh, because I grew up, you know, I have one brother, one sister. And then the first place I moved to, I think I was around three, four. I see a Pakistani boy standing on top of a slide in a playground. He throws his bike down the slide and the slide goes. And I was like, wow, that's so cool. He's so <laughs> strong. And then I went to him. And then that was my first friend, okay. you know. So ever since then, we Hassan Ali. Mm -hmm. So after that, I just realized that I'm living in the middle of a neighborhood with Indians, Albanians, Turkish, Pakistani, you know, Somalians. Like we are a melting pot of cultures. Yeah. So growing up in that neighborhood, you learn a lot about the food, you know. Yeah. You had the jalebi, oh. uh, you had the pizza with the green chili. <laughs> uh, you get to eat, you know, naan bread a lot very often. Yeah. And those are the things that they could bring out. Yeah. But once I met these guys, yeah. Surman Bilal, around 2003 was the time we kind of like spent a lot of time together. That was when I started going home to their houses. And yeah. that was when I got, you know, uh, introduced to all the dishes, you yeah. know, you, the... Uh, the alu gosht was the one that really like uh, you love stuck it? with me. Yeah, because I like. I also I like really it. It like so alu simple. gosht. It's very warm and, yeah. and fuzzy. I and like you that. have it with the naan. Yes, it with the naan, so and and uh, I was basically I think there's no Pakistani cuisine that I haven't tried because of their house. Mm, nice. If there is any, then it's very rare. Uh, okay. So yeah, I've been having a lot of the culture but, through that. But um, in terms of practices or in terms of the way they meet or do certain things, anything that fascinates you or anything that you have picked up that you also do now? Mm, I don't think I've told you that. I have, have, I have a Pakistani family as well. Oh, you do? Well. Yes. Okay, I'm so, so sorry. So if I go, no, no, don't be, if I go to Laos, uh, which is north of for Thailand, the whole house speaks mm. Urdu. Oh, so you already Nobody have speaks Urdu. Nobody when speaks. I, when I uh, came to Thailand first time to visit his family, and I saw like, I'm like, is this your family? It's like, yeah, <laughs> it's like Pakistanis. Oh, yeah. Okay. So, so I'm already like infused with Pakistani culture in my house. My auntie have like the best biryani shop mm. in Thailand. Mm. Okay. My, uh, she has a shop in Thailand? Yes. Oh, wow. And yeah. my cousin, he makes roti. My cousin makes roti, you know, but the, the Malay roti, you know. Yeah. So, I mean, like the chai culture is very strong in my house, the biryani and I just have a lot of uh, I, I remember I was in Thailand in a wedding. Yes. Uh, and uh, Nasir gave me this ring as gift yeah. and uh, from Thailand. And we went to Thailand, we were in this Thai wedding. I was sitting in a table with other guests and it was an elder woman sitting beside me. And she said, I made your ring. And I was like, huh? 
Wow. <laughs> really? She said, yes, yeah, it was me. And she was, she was speaking Urdu to me. Yeah. Nice. So it was very fascinating to see Thai, Lao, yeah. Pakistani. So it's more f they're more fascinated by <laughs> that I have uh, <laughs> I know, exactly Pakistani right. in my family. <laughs> yeah. Okay, let's let's uh, do a fun segment. Okay. We'll play a fun game with you guys and let's see if you guys how well you guys know each other. Okay. And then okay. Okay, are you guys ready? Yes. Okay, first question. Who's most likely to impress a cute girl in the crowd? And let's see if you guys have it, it has to be between the three of you, okay? Okay. Are you guys ready with your answer? Yes. Okay, show us. Nasir. <laughs> okay. <laughs> <laughs> no, he thinks. <laughs> but two are correct. Yeah. So all of us. <laughs> okay, no, so there's a, Nasir. there's a competition between the two of you. Yes. Have you guys ever done us. that? Yes, of yeah. course. What, what did you do? Tell us. No, I think he is hmm. just magic when he moves. Hmm. You know? Yeah. I don't move that much, okay. but I make sure they they are safe in the like. Uh, yeah, they actually, feel Nassim most. Yeah. I'm I'm forty percent. He's sixty. Okay. Then you have to change your answer. Nassim. <laughs> <laughs> I I was like writing like this. Answer one. Nassim. <laughs> answer Nassim. two. Trying to be like nice to the environment, but it's okay. Who's most conscious about how they look while performing? Oh. oh. Uh. <laughs> Let's do it immediately and everyone is maybe right. Suleiman. Suleiman, what's taking you so long? <laughs> but, no, it's no. me and Nasir against you. You lost. It's you. Is it? It's, it's you. I he believe cannot it's move. You see, if you don't look the way he wanted, he can't move. Seriously? Yes. Seriously? Yes. There has been times when he's like, how's my shirt? How's my look at me. Do you think I care? No, like no, I'm no. Very but very he, he's very aware on how he dances. Yeah. Okay. okay. I can be suddenly on the floor and then suddenly back and later. That's true, but you still are Later aware. I see the video, I'm like, what am I doing? Why am I doing that? You yeah. know? And he's always precise. Yeah. He knows himself. Yeah. True. Okay, next. Right? Next. True. I like this game. I'm not wrong. Who complains the most but ends up doing the best? I would say it's the <laughs> It's Vilani, you think? <laughs> it's me. It's Vilani. 100%. I need to complain. You, you know, it's complain. much cooler when we show the answer. You know the why same I need time. to complain? Because we have Nasir, his sun sunshine, always positive, which I love. Yeah. And it's important. Sulman is too confident, and yeah. then I need to be the guy <laughs> who's complaining. You yeah. know, confidence, happy, positive, complaining. And you guys must be like, oh. Ignore him. He's yeah, no, his, actually not. Nasir is the best friend of me. He before we did it, we yeah. before, but now we we have to. They respect it now. Yeah, they have to team. because. What did you do that they, they actually two. respect this now? Results. Results. Okay. Okay. No, okay. We another. Just didn't want to hear any more complaints. 